Butchake English for Teens. Welcome to Butchake English for Teens. I'm Alex Schroer. And I'm Josh Barnard. Let's get started by watching today's skit. What should we do when they get here? We could go sledding, we could build a snowman, we could have a snowball fight. Ouch! Gotcha! I'll get you for that. Oops. What did I do to deserve this? Ouch, that looked like it hurt. Yeah, poor Kamal. He was in the wrong place at the wrong time. Did you catch what he said when he got smashed in the face by Hillary's snowball? Ow? Actually, no, he really took it on the chin. Impressive. Oh, yeah, he said, What did I do to deserve this? Right? That's it. Deserve means that the consequences of your actions are fair. For example, if you studied really hard for a test and then got a perfect score, you would deserve it. It's also used for bad actions. If you cheated on the test and then failed, you would deserve it. So Kamal was wondering what bad action he had done to earn such a bad consequence. It doesn't seem like he deserved it, though. I guess sometimes bad things just happen to good people, like when I lost my keys. Uh, didn't you throw them at a seagull? I wasn't about to let him eat my sandwich. Our mote on point for today is how to pronounce should and could. Or rather, how not to pronounce them. When these words appear in a sentence, they're usually not pronounced clearly. Let's look at how Hillary used should. What should we do when they get here? It's really quick, so you might not have caught it. But the end of the word is skipped, so it sounds like should. Let's try that together. Repeat after me. Sh. Sh. What should we do? You can do the same thing with could. We could go sledding. See how the end is dropped? It's not could, just k. Now let's try that one. Could. Could. We could go sledding. One small warning. This only happens when should and could are followed by a word that starts with a consonant. If the next word starts with a vowel, or if the sentence just ends, you would pronounce it as normal. Should we give them an example? Yes, we should. But I just can't think of one. Hmm. Should I ask someone? Ah, it's probably fine. Well, that's all for today. Be sure to try these phrases out and don't forget to have fun. See you next week. Butchake English for Teens.